what's good i'm back video i'm just gonna be showing you guys all of the paintings i've done or i'm currently doing it's been requested like a couple times in my comments and i've just been like too lazy to get all my paintings out and show you guys most of them are on my instagram but i know a lot of you guys don't follow me on instagram but you should really go follow me on instagram so I'm just going to show them all here and explain their meaning because I also don't explain most of their meanings on Instagram either. But anyways, that's the video idea today. I'm just going to be explaining my art. So I'm going to start with this one because this one I did on my page. There's a time lapse of this one. But I, nobody asked me the meaning. Like I feel like this is a pretty weird painting. Like This painting like I just saw in my head one day. I guess that's just kind of how all my paintings are. A lot of people ask me where I get my creativity from. It just comes to me, I guess. But I am terrified of rabbits. Rabbits are my worst fear. Well, I guess not my worst, but I am terrified of rabbits. So I don't know, just like the heads of decapitated rabbits just seemed like perfectly ominous to me. And then Cry Me a Dream, like, I feel like when I'm at my darkest, that's when I dream the brightest. I don't know if that makes sense, but that's what I mean when I say cry me a dream. And these eyeballs with the mushrooms sprouting out of them, that's just like something that I came up with one day that I just try to put throughout all my art. But yeah, that's really it for this painting. The rest of it, the colors, everything. The colors were just the prettiest colors I could find at Home Depot. Like, I don't know, they don't mean anything. But yeah, there's that pa painting number two. Oh, Jesus. This one, I... I guess it doesn't really have a meaning, like I painted this cop car down here, not because I'm political or anything, but I just really like the old TV show 21 Jump Street, not the movie, the TV show with young Johnny Depp, teacups, I really like teacups, I have a teacup tattooed on my leg, and this cloud, I just think it looked cool with eyeballs, I don't know, maybe it represents like the government watching over you, I don't know, interpret it how you want. But it also has those eyeballs that I like drawing, I don't know, the ones that are on this painting. Painting number three, this, yeah, that's like the best and worst thing that's ever happened to me. First person to tell me what these flowers are that I painted on it, you're the coolest person that watched this video. This saying right here is actually a Russian, it's in Russian, but it's a Stephen King quote. Like I love Stephen, wait. Okay, yeah, I'm right, it's by Stephen King. I love Stephen King, see like, I have too many books. Either way, this quote is a Stephen King quote. It says, love like any other strong and addicting drug gets boring. I don't know. I just thought that looked really cool. So, yeah. Okay, this painting, I have such... Mm, I have such a love-hate relationship with. This was the first, like, big canvas I had. I actually made it myself. You can see how, like, warped and shit it is. And I did an acrylic drip, which I, is actually like one of my biggest pet peeves now in the art world is drip paintings. But I can't even lie, it looks pretty cool and it made my next door neighbor really proud of me. So I keep it around, you know, whatever. It's, it is what it is. It's cool. It's pretty. It's, it's average, whatever. So here are some paintings I'm like currently working on right now. This one I've been working on for quite a while. This is just the baddest bitch. I know. If you're watching this, hey, you're the baddest bitch I know. Um, I'll finish it, I promise, eventually. I just, I got a lot to finish right now, you know? This one, it's kind of hard to see. This is for my dad, actually. It's the scene from Fight Club. Fight Club's my favorite movie, if anybody out there likes Fight Club. You're cool. This is the first scene from Fight Club where he hits himself, I guess you could say. If you haven't seen Fight Club, you don't get it. You hit me again. <laughs> no, you hit me. Come on. It's my dad at his current age beating the shit out of my younger dad. I haven't finished it either, but I think it looks pretty good. This one actually looks pretty bad on camera right now. It is the lighting. Um, it looks really bad on camera right now, but this one is actually one that I was paid to do. They just wanted a trippy Rick and Morty, um, Midnight Gospel, looks good under black light type painting for their music studio. So this is what I have so far. It's kind of like a sneak peek of my next video because I'm actually doing a time lapse of this whole thing. It's like pretty big as you can tell. Like, you know, 
it's like the size of me. I don't know. I feel like it's pretty big. So there's going to be a whole time lapse of this one coming out. So I'm not going to go too much into detail for it because there's going to be a whole video on it. But yeah. Okay, I have like a bunch of paintings right here. I'm just going to go through real quick. This one, it's called City of Angels. I don't really know how to explain it. It's kind of something you just get. Well, I can't explain it. It'll just take too long. Dave from Space Odyssey. I don't know what you're talking about, Hal. Joji slash pink guy slash filthy Frank. <laughs> Johnny Depp from Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. Well, on that list, but we must have that sweet. Yes, we must have that sweet. What's the score? Jack from The Shining. Kurt Cobain. I said no. no. I said heck you were, no. You were an and an unfinished piece of Walt and Jesse. Ah, what is it from? Ah! This is like my favorite painting for a lot of reasons. I'll put up a picture of it. You can look at it. There's a lot to see in it. So yeah, it looks like a fourth grader did it, but I really love it. So it's like four days later. I've been too lazy to record this. Either way, I'm not that good at talking videos, so I'm sorry if this was boring for you guys. I'm used to like doing time lapse videos. I think I'm pretty good at time lapse videos. I just don't know how to talk to like people I can't see. But if it wasn't, just tell me I can do another one like this. I have plenty of drawings. I have so many drawings, so I can do one of my drawings. Just let me know. Did I say bye or did I just end the video? Follow me. No, I'm just saying, I don't know. Follow me. <laughs> follow my Instagram. Just a like, subscribe, follow my Instagram.